This is the big one, Breeders' Cup Classic, 1 mile 2, Group 1 on the dirt. Aussie and Shan for Dan Hughes, 100 to 1. Foreman for Davy Led, 4 to 1. Ithaca Circle for Vinnie Gerard, 12 to 1. It's Passion, Not Profit for Leon Van Rensburg, 14s. Lambs Bear for Dan Hughes, 100s. Pathmaster for Josh Sutherland, 10 to 3 joint favourite. Missiles Lock for Paul Rhodes, 100s. Organised State for Leon, 100s. Patterson's Return for James Shea, 10 to 3 joint favourite. Sadia Fear Stopper for Davy Led, 20s. Eisenbar Brunel for Paul Rhodes, 100s. Time to play the game for Josh, 11s. Trumpet Coup for James Shea, 5 to 1. Grand Forks, Desperate for Vinny, 50 to 1. Two eyed Daruska for Darren Thompson, 100 to 1. And they're starting right on the bend here. It's two turns for the Breeders' Cup Classic. They're off. Organised state in front for Leon. And there's quite a few caught wide. The two Josh Sutherland horses there are caught wide. And his uh, attempt for six Breeders' Cup wins in a row on the final day. And Pathmaster does take it up for Josh. Pathmaster in front and going pretty quickly here trying to get this lead four lengths clear of its passion not profit Aussie and Shan missiles locked on the outside if a circle time to play the game is a little wide it was with Eisenbar Brunel Lamb's Bear is also along amongst them with organized state Grand Forks desperation then the back four are a little detached with two right two eyed Daruska Sedefir Stopper and the two James Shea horses going to be trying to stay on from the back into the halfway point of the Breeders' Cup Classic. It's the big one, and Pathmaster is being held onto and fills the tank ready for the way home in the Classic. Pathmaster from Aussie Anshan for Dan Hughes, who certainly does well in these big dirt races, and he'll be looking to win this one. Ithaca Circle going well for Vinnie Gerard there in second. Aussie Anshan, time to play the game, is now up into third for Josh. Also coming around the organised state, Eisenbar Brunel all trying to stay on. Grand Forks Desperation trying to stay on. Path Master leads them into the final four furlongs of the Classic. From Ithaca Circle, organised state, time to play the game. Eisenbar Brunel, Grand Forks Desperation, Lambs Bear and Aussie Anshan are still on the premises. Four man and missiles locked is trying to stay on. No move from the James Shea horses yet. Looks like Trumpet Coup is going to be trying to make the best of its way home into the final two and a half. Going towards the final two and Path Master is still in front is going to try to go pillar the post in the Breeders' Cup Classic. Lambs Bear has come through but isn't getting closer. There's a furlong and a half left to go. Here comes Ithaca Circle trying to stay on for Vinny Gerard. Time to play the game. Also staying on for Josh. But it's Path Master with furlong left to go. They've got to come some to get him. But time to play the game. His stable mate is also trying to get there down the middle. Foreman and Trumpet Coup are staying on. Foreman flashing home late. Path Master from Foreman. Path Master and Foreman is a photo in the classic. Who's got it? I think Path Master might have the rail to help. Has Josh won a sixth Breeders' Cup race in a row, or has Foreman nicked it down the outside? There it is, Pathmaster, your six to one winner of the Breeders' Cup Classic, goes pillar to post in the Classic. Big win there, Pathmaster, Josh Sutherland, nearly three million in the pot for him there, six to one. Foreman, a great run late, at three, uh, three to one. The second Josh horse was third, I can't remember the name. Time to play the game was third, 15 to 2. Trumpet coup for James Shea was fourth, 4 to 1. Instead of fear stop at fifth for David Ladd at 100s.